Hey Hi guys. guys! It's Tristan, the marketing assistant here at ID Supplies. And Kristen from the sales department. And today, uh, Kristen's going to be demonstrating how to install the Assure ID software. Using the DTC 1250E, we'll be running through from start to finish how quick and easy it is um, to get the software up, your templates done and printed a card. So Kristen's going to be printing me out just a standard ID card that I would use day to day in the office. Um, so you'll see that along with a cool lanyard and just like a little fob just an, as, as an example to show you. Um, so let's do it. Let's go. All right. All right. So now I'm going to download the drivers. There's two I need to download. So I'm going to go across to the HID website now. Click on that and then go down to download and start downloading these drivers. You need to hit I accept once you've read all the information. and it's starting to download on the left. So while that's happening now, I'm gonna go across to the second um, tab that I have open here on the HID website to download the Assure ID setup, which is the software that you use to print your cards and design your templates. So I'm gonna click download on that one as well. Download, it's gonna pop up another screen. I accept. Come on. And that's going to start downloading as well. So while we're waiting for this to download, I just wanted to show you this page here, which is hidglobal.com forward slash drivers. This is the page where you'll find all the drivers for all of the Fargo printers that HID stock. So you just go across to here, this little search bar here, search by product. You can type in if you have a DTC Oh, waiting, 4250E, enter, and it'll pop up here. So it's the same steps, you click on that, download, I accept, and that will download for you. So we've just finished um, downloading the drivers, now we're gonna install the drivers onto the computer. So we're just gonna go into our folder here, and then go up to extract the file. Okay, we're extracting now. This is the driver here. We're just gonna double click on this now. Let that load up. So pretty much from here, it's just next. Uh, I agree and accept the license. Next. Local, next. Next. A lot of next. It's going to install the software for us. It's installing now. Okay, so the software has finished installing. Now we're going to turn the printer on and connect the USB cable to both the PC and the printer. So I'm going to go ahead and push the button to turn it on. And then I'm going to get the USB cable here. And plug that into the side of my PC. She's talking. So the card printer's been installed onto my laptop now. The laptop needs to be uh, rebooted for everything to take effect. So I'm gonna go right ahead and do that now. Click the finish button and it's restarting. So the, so the laptop has just restarted as you saw. The printer has been installed onto the computer now. So now we're gonna install the Assure ID software. So I'm gonna go all the way up to Assure ID, ID setup, yep. Yes, that's going to install. This may take a little bit. Okay, now that's loaded. So from here, it's the same process as before, just next, next, next. So while that was loading, we just made a quick coffee. It's ready to go now. So we just again do the next process. I accept the license agreement. Next, select the printer, which is the DTC 1250E. Next, next. So that download is successful. We're just gonna hit okay. 
It's going to bring up the Assure ID uh, setup now just to complete it. I'm just going to click finish. Just had to have a read. Now it's going to load the software. Oh wow, that screen looks cool. Okay, the activation um, pop-up has now come on. We've put Express and we're just going to hit continue. So the software has finished downloading. It's time to log in. The default username, ID and password is admin admin. So we're just going to go ahead and pop that in now. Admin and admin. And we're just going to select OK. This is the basic template design. So from here, this is where you go ahead and start playing with your design and how you want it to look like. So we're going to go ahead and make an ID for Tristan as discussed at the beginning of the video. So let's go ahead mm -hmm. and design that. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and create Tristan's um, ID card. So what we're going to do first is add our background. So we come across to the background, add a background to the front of the card. There is a whole lot of defaults in here by HID. You can scroll through, but today we're going to browse and we're going to click on the card background, open that up. Okay, it's going to load it for us. Then Looks we're, great. Then we're going to add a photo. So we're going to just drop it in here to put Tristan's ID card photo. <laughs> Time up photo. Now we want to put the name, um, employee number, and position. So we're just going to click data field, drag and drop. Okay, we're going to call that name. Select OK. And we're going to put in another one. Wow, so it's really simple. It's just drag and drop. It's very simple. So you select and then you just make a little square and then the prompt will come up. So, and number. So anyone can do this. Anyone can do this. It's very, very simple. So you've got my name and position and then you're putting in, what else are you putting in there? Your ID. My ID number? Position, sorry, position. Your employee oh. number's already there, so oh, I'm gonna okay. select position. Okay, so I've got it to how I want it now, so what we're gonna do is, first step is we're gonna save this template. So save template as, and we'll just name it ID cards for now. So we click okay. All right. Now we're gonna add Tristan's photo. So we're going to go over to data entry on the left hand side here. And we're going to click add. All right. In data entry, we're just going to bring Tristan's image up for the ID card. So I've just gone load from file. We're going to open it. Just move it to where we would like it. So we'll put it about there. And we click OK. Populate Tristan's details, so Tristan, marketing assistant, and employer ID, she's number four, number four. So now we're just going to save that and we're ready to print. So what we're going to do now is load the, load the printer with consumables, so we'll need a ribbon and some ID blank ID cards, so we're going to do that now. Tristan, would you mind passing me a, a ribbon please? Yeah, sure. So this so is our full color um, HID Fargo ribbon. Yeah, so it's a YMCKO full color. It'll do 250 prints out of this ribbon, full color one side. So we're just gonna pop that in there, close the front. Really easy. Very easy. And we're just gonna grab some cards. We'll take this brand new stack of 100, which I can't open. <laughs> I won't put them all in. So we're just going to open this little door here, push down. Load the cards in, close. It'll automatically push up ready for print. Okay, that's really easy. Yes. We'll see on the card that we're about to print, it will say trial all over it as we've downloaded the trial version. Once you purchase the full license, that will disappear. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and quick print. Okay, I'll come around so they can get a better view. Yeah, so we just quick print. The PC is talking to the printer now. It's going to take a card from the right side and it's going to bring it out on the left. Mm -hmm. 
while we're waiting for that, I did take the liberty of getting you a lanyard and a card holder ready for your ID, so that you're oh, all wow. set up, ready to go once this card comes out. And that's the CHFV 14. 14 yeah, yeah, so it's a very strong reinforced plastic that a lot of government are using at the moment. Mm, card is done, populace. that's how quick it is. So we're gonna open this little flap here, pull out your card, and there it is. Oh, wow, that looks awesome. The colors are really vibrant. Can see my round head. <laughs> That's we, awesome. So we're just gonna pop that in there, like that. This is a lockable card holder, as you can see here. Mm -hmm. I've got my fob, sorry, your fob here. So we're just gonna click it through, ready to go. Oh so wow! Your ID is there. Your fob's on the back. You mm -hmm. do have a carabiner and the safety breakaway as well. Mm -hmm. You're ready to go. That's awesome. Thank you so much for showing us that, Not Chris. No problem. If you have any questions, guys, give us a call. We'll be more than happy to help you out. We do have Carly in tech support as well, who is available 9 to 5 to answer all your questions regarding printers and software. Awesome. Thank you so much. No worries. Okay, so that's it for episode 10, Coffee with ID Supplies. We hope this episode has been informative when it comes to an entry-level card printer and how easy it is to print out staff identification. Um, if you have any further questions, please give us a call or send us an email at sales at idsupplies.com.au. We'll be happy to take your phone calls and answer your questions. Yeah, and if you want, please give this video a share. Um, you can also subscribe to our YouTube channel if you want to see more. Um, and feel free to leave any questions in the comments or anything that you want to see in future episodes. Okay. Thanks, guys. Bye. Bye. Bye.